The good times lies ahead for agriculture and for ICA. I am an optimistic person. As you probably may know, I am passionate of my ideas. I think I am ready to lead the process of FICA, understand it, that I am the one that has to interpret the demands and needs of the member countries. ICA won't belong to the next Director General. ICA belongs to the member country. And the main vir virtue of the next Director General is try to interpret what uh, the countries need in order to reposition ICA and be a more protagonistic institution. What do I imagine? What are the new functions of ICA? I strongly believe in differentiated strategies. Uh, any strategy for any, for, for any region and sub-region, ICA has to be much better aligned with the regional and the national development plans. I cannot imagine any rep uh, acting or taking a decision in an in a isolated way has to be aligned with the priorities expressed by the regional, sub-regional, and national, at the national level. Uh, I strongly believe in South-South cooperation. It seems to me that if IFICA can systematize all the experience in the different countries and sub-regions and regions, uh, and can, uh, this information can be shared, uh, we can speed up the transformation of, of agriculture. So, I strongly believe in South-South cooperation. ICA has to strengthen its capacity trans to transform the political signals in good projects. It is my opinion that during the last period, ICA has weakened this capacity uh, in the area of project formulation. In my view, any, any ICA technician has to be transformed in a, in a soldier with capacity for project formulation. Those institutions with good projects will be in a better position to get access to the different funds. Uh, but we have to, to we, we need to get, to have uh, good projects.